might need a heater tonight. Yeah, it was, it's going to be as chilly as last night. Wow. Some places can't rule out some 30s tonight. In fact, in those outlying colder areas, oh, but we are not done with the heat by okay. any okay. means in the week ahead. You're happy. But you know what? We're all, you know what? We're already looking ahead. We're looking ahead to tomorrow morning. That's right. Tomorrow morning, that tailgating forecast. Opening game, 56 degrees at 8 o'clock in the morning, 65 at 10 o'clock. Kickoff temperature, 70 degrees at beautiful Soldier Field, which is now painted. It is looking great. And now... Uh, it's just it's time to get going, right? Yeah, we got a lot of people out and about right now here in the downtown city of St. Charles. I'm walking around enjoying that sunshine. Sunshine as well here on the north side of the city as we look off to the west. Just a few clouds here and there from our weather bug camera top WGN. 67 was the high today, made it to 48 this morning. Let's see if I jump forward and then come back. Let's see if it'll actually, aha, see, there you go, 48 degrees. Normals, 61 and 79, so we'll colder than the averages. Your record stand at 42 and 100. Sunset this evening will come at 714. Right now, mainly sunny to O'Hare, 65 degrees. A north northeast breeze at 12. Look at that dew point down into the lower 40s. We are going to see dry air from here well into the work week. And with this drier air mass, we're going to see some big temperatures uh, from morning temperatures to afternoon highs. We're all right now in the 60s, anywhere from 61 in the city to 67 in Joliet, 65 in Midway. We got some mid 60s down from places like Streeter, Peru, Kankakee all at 66 degrees with these northerly winds continuing between 5 and we'll say 15 miles per hour. But they still make some hefty waves out there in Lake Michigan. So that beach hazard statement for all these highlighted counties will continue until 4 o'clock in the morning. Tomorrow, of course, not exactly a swimming kind of day anyway. Clouds over northwest Indiana moving further to the east. Now more so in the northwestern or southwestern parts of Michigan. High pressure going to be our friend. Look at much of the U.S. here. We are pretty quiet. We're going to watch a little disturbed weather down here in the Gulf though. There is a potential we may get something happening down there that may impact our weather next weekend. Next weekend. That's a long ways off between now and then. We're just going to have a couple of ridges. One on the surface, one in the upper level is going to be staying over top of us. We're going to watch for mainly clear skies here this evening, overnight, tonight, tomorrow, plenty of sunshine, noon kickoff. Look at all that sunshine there with the west wind will say right around 10 miles per hour thereabouts. That sunshine continues into the afternoon, mainly clear tomorrow night, Monday. Back to work and school with abundant sunshine and we're still continuing a warm up that starts tomorrow for we go from our Monday into our Tuesday, Tuesday more of a southerly breeze and mainly sunny skies there as well. Temperatures getting above average and getting way above average late in the work week. How about your forecast at highs for tomorrow? Computer models are saying low to mid 70s, 73 places like Harvard to uh, DeKalb, 75 at O'Hare, 74 Waukegan, 75 at Chicago, Midway, Joliet, 74 Ottawa to Aurora. Lower 70s here into the mid 70s or about Maryville 73 Lansing Kankakee all the same. As we look ahead to the rest of this evening and tonight mainly clear chilly and dry as we drop into the upper 40s. Cannot completely rule out some 30s in those colder outlying areas and it looks like in the city a little bit warm. We'll stay in the 50s there. Then tomorrow mostly sunny high of 75 degrees that includes at the lakefront. On Monday, abundant sunshine, comfortably warm. No, we're not going to see the humidity levels on the rise. So we're up to 83 degrees on Monday, and that's just the start of above average temperatures. How about mid 80s here on Tuesday, upper 80s on Wednesday, and 90 on Thursday. After starting out in the lower 60s, big temperature swings from morning to afternoon. Cooler at the lakefront here for uh, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, but still warmer than average with the uh, dry air mass in place. That's why you can have a day that starts out in the lower 60s and warms up nearly 30 degrees. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, maybe the AC is not done running quite yet. Mm -hmm. well, some people grab them for the blanket tonight, like you said, and others mm. saying, hey, where's that air conditioner? Let's get it cranked up later in the work week. So, interesting times ahead. Uh, September. There you it go. It always happens, right? Thank you much, Mike.